Building snow anchors and building rock anchors follow many of the same principles. The force placed on snow anchors tends to be less than on rock. The exception to this would be haul systems for crevasse rescue. Snow anchors tend to be easier to equalize because unlike rock protection, you can choose where to place them. When building anchors, there are many acronyms used as a checklist to make sure your anchor is relatively safe and acceptable. SERENA is one acronym I typically use. The S stands for solid, meaning the individual primary components are solid and well placed. For snow, what this means is I have chosen the appropriate T-trench or vertical placed picket or ice axe. R stands for redundant. This means that if any one component of the anchor system fails, the whole anchor does not fail. E stands for equalized. This means if I apply a force to the master point, then the force is evenly distributed between the individual anchor components. Sometimes this can be set up as pre-equalized. If you know the direction of pull will not change. Otherwise, when and where the direction of pull is changing, you would try for active equalization. NE is for no extensions. This means that if one component fails, it will not shock load the remaining pieces of the larger system. We can minimize extension through the use of load limiting knots for anchors that need active equalization, or we can just use pre-equalized knots. A is for angle. We want to keep the vector angle as low as possible. For snow and ice anchors, we're able to make this angle zero by setting primary anchors in series or in a straight line. Oftentimes, for snow belays, two pieces may be adequate. But for belays from ice screws, where there may be solar meltout, I use three to four screws, especially if people will be using the anchors for top roping, which tends to put the greatest force on the anchor due to the cyclical loading. Many of these anchor concepts can be reviewed in our videos in the rock anchors and traditional climbing. However, please watch our videos on individual snow anchors for a deeper understanding of these proven alpine techniques.